Hi guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today's vlog, because yes, it's a vlog even though I'm sitting in front of the camera, um, will be me being in Milan and going to Chinatown with my friend Martina. Uh, I'm really excited to see her again. Last time I saw her was last October and right now it's June. So uh, it's been a while and I'm really excited to see her. But first, right now, it's already super late. It's 12, 14. I woke up around 11 and I just chilled, cleaned up, prepped myself, pampered myself. And that was really good. And right now I'm sitting in my brand new top that I really, really adore. Probably the camera will stop functioning because it's so stippily. But whatever. Um, I will record a shop lock afterwards because I shopped way too much to show you. Uh, yeah, awkward. <laughs> Let's have lunch slash breakfast slash brunch slash whatever you want to call it first. Ja, fantastisch! Und wie auch immer. Gut, ja, Ah, Simone. Ciao, Ciao, ragazzi. I present Real Italian Pizza by a Real Italian Mama. By a Real Italian Mama. <laughs> yes, 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 guys. And I'm making uh, the same thing I made yesterday, which is. <coughs> this uh, vegan thingy with some pesto moment please and tomatoes and also a little obviously a little bit of pizza um but without cheese so it's vegan yay oh, these are the moments where i'm like i'd really like to eat meat and cheese right now this looks so amazing and my shiny vegan bit. So basically, what you do is you add half a glass of water and 250 grams of these spinach uh, gnocchi ish thingies, um, a scoop of pesto, vegan pesto or just regular pesto, if, depending on if you're vegan or not, uh, a shit ton of salt that makes everything good, and pepper. And you can add some fresh tomatoes if you like. You don't have to. But that's really great together. I love it. A kitchen blog. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, kind of. Oh my god, how good does this look? My kitchen blog followers. <laughs> oh. And obviously, not vegan, but looks amazing. The second course, how's that? Mm. It's so hot outside. Why didn't it, nobody warn me about the fact that long sleeves and long pants are not a good idea? I'm on, the, uh, on my way to Garibaldi to meet Martina there. I'm going to Chinatown. I'm super excited. Hopefully not going to spend any money. Probably will though. I need a phone case. Otherwise I'll break my phone. So that's a good reason. Um, my outfit. You can see it in the previous shot. I'm not going to show it here. I might ask her to film in. The vibe of the music I'm listening to of Kid You Not is five and uh, by this Dutch band. It's the worst music you could possibly think of. I won't put it in the description but my Dutch friends will know. I was um, texting with a friend of mine and therefore I missed my subway stop and I feel like such a moron so I stuck on the subway to the stop uh, where I am right now. I don't know what it's called. I think it's Loreto. Uh, and I'm taking the green line now to uh, Garibaldi. Always running late. Running late with more. I should call my YouTube channel probably. Anyhow, um, I saw this girl on the uh, metro and she was like wearing this really skinny jeans, uh, black skinny jeans with sneakers and she had a backpack, a black, tiny backpack, a tiny um, bag in front and a white t-shirt and like a step counter and she was super skinny, not wearing any makeup, hair uh, loose but with um, a hair elastic and I just immediately recognized her as a model who was doing casting you see them so often in Milan, it's so funny because I recognize it from when I'm doing castings myself when I have shoots and uh, stuff like that so uh, it's really funny to see like fellow models, let's say it like that 
One day I will be here doing all kinds of castings, living in Milan. That'll be my goal. What is this church called? Uh, Santo Antonio. Santo Antonio. Well, it's really pretty. So, um, I just got out of the metro and ended up seeing my friend Martina! <laughs> We just walked into a shop and we kind of got into a fight with this lady because <laughs> yeah. um, I was asking for the prices. It's Chinatown, so you can obviously get the price down. And then she told me it was like, what was it, 43 for the three items? And I was like, I'll take the three for 10 bucks. And, and she, she just, and she left and she was like, ha, and then she walked <laughs> away. And I was like, oh my God, you rude ass bitch. And I really wanted like the top and skirt. So eventually we got it for 20. But, which, which is nice, but I had to get <laughs> cash because I had 19 cash and they refused to let me pay with card. Ugh, whatever, I got it and it's really nice. So I'm got happy him. with that. Yes, ching ching. <laughs> and now there will be a piece of my vlog from yesterday in which I told you guys I wouldn't spend any more money. Not spending anything tomorrow or the day after. Well, I screwed up. Oh my gosh, you guys, what the hell? <laughs> so we're at Martina's place and she's having <laughs> she's having chocolate pudding and I'm having an apple healthy versus non healthy. See the difference, catch the difference. <laughs> um and we're trying to get Netflix in English because no, it doesn't, doesn't work <laughs> even. <laughs> but it just doesn't work and that's really great. <laughs> So I just got off the bus to home. I had a lot of fun with Martina. It was so great seeing her again. I will definitely, um, obviously come back to Milan, so definitely see her again then. It was a lot of fun. It was really great just chilling at her place and um, didn't really feel like filming much more. Um, so I'm almost home. I'm starving, so I'm thinking I'm making a really nice salad. Um, tortellini or maybe what is it called? The other tortellini. It slips my tongue every time I try to think of it. Uh, ah, <laughs> whatever. Um, so yeah, a food porn shot really soon. Insert it in three, two, one. Prosciutto, the only real cioè, one. Le zucchine, una cosa, prendi tipo il pane, ti do il prosciutto, così ti fai tu un dessert and just make a bruschetta out of everything. This will be the prettiest position that I'll ever end my vlog in, so thank you guys for watching. No, perché? Il cazzo. Thank you guys for watching. I would love to see you with a brand new vlog tomorrow from Milan. Seeing my friend Federico. Super excited. I don't know what I'm saying. Anyhow, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Lots of love and hearts.